Hi Pisces, let's see what is going on for you, Pisces Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All right. Someone is anxious and heartbroken. They have a heavy heart around this connection or this situation with you. They have meant to be. Oh, that means they did something. Meant to be or meant to be soulmates. They're watching social media. They have a lot of pride. But they can't let go. If this someone can't let you go. Somebody is someone is still heartbroken over you, Pisces. Somebody who may have, you know, not wanted a connection in the past, may have left. I have Virgo energy under the deck. I see Capricorn too. But all right, so someone is anxious and heartbroken, heavy heart, and it's meant to be because you guys were soul soulmates. And they're looking on social media. Ten of Cups fell out. I got the death card under the deck, but Ten of Cups count in reverse. There may have been an addiction or someone else or something else that got in the way of this connection. It could also be fear. They may have also had a fear of commitment. They may see you as walking away. What you don't see is possibly messages, communication. They may try to manifest you back. I see you can't see that. So maybe we'll get it. Okay. Wow. Yeah, this person feels like they really screwed this up, Pisces. I feel somebody here who really regrets the past, regrets what they did or didn't do. Um, they want to come towards you now. They may show up at your job or something or show up when you're working or you're busy or at the gym or something. Maybe they're going to come in and tell you that they want to put effort into this and work on this. They could be wanting to do something differently. Yeah, this person's ready for commitment now. They want to give you the ace of coin, wanting to work this out. This may be shocking to you, Tower. And this could prompt an argument between the two of you, but I don't know. This, I get this is going to be surprising. I get like there's one last like conversation you're going to have with this person and then it's up to you what you want to do. You're going to think about it. I feel like this person is going to like show up, get to you no matter what, say what they need to say. And then if you say no, they're going to be heartbroken still. But if you say yes, maybe you guys could work this out. What is going on for Pisces? Okay. Something about a home or a foundation. Sorry. So they're saying they're apologizing for not giving you a home, not working on the connection, not giving you a solid foundation. They are afraid. But there's such a oh, they're afraid because there's such a strong attraction. It says afraid of love. So this person may have a fear of love. Being loved, not feeling worthy is what's coming up here. Needing to surrender disputes. It says legal matters, but disputes and Independent, being more independent, legal matters, being independent, being free of that, and rebuilding. There's something like they need to let go to. Could be a toxic ex, toxic um, divorce connection, something like that. Surrendering disputes, independent. Of course, it could also be codependent, is also what I'm getting here from those cards and the devil energy. It could be that you're not. So it's like the two of you just aren't going to work if one of you is and one of you are, but maybe they've been working on themselves. They could be seeing that with the hermit energy. So they say they want to kiss you. They need to tell you the truth. They want to make things right. They wish you were there with them and they just can't let you go. Wow. I feel like someone's very heartbroken. Wow. Okay. What does spirit want you to know about this Pisces? I think they had a lot of pride in the past or something, or they don't want to show it on social media. If they post things, they don't want you to be able to tell that they're sad. They may post pictures with other people. This is your soulmate. So you got soulmates in both decks. Wow. So soul connection, partnership, soul contract, and a life partner. Receiving some sort of help. It says leg up. The feminine energy. Listen to your intuition. They may want to give you something or help you with something. or They're saying to listen to your intuition around that. They may be doing something nice to make up for the past. So, what is this? Pisces. A full, a brand new beginning. Some sort of conversation or communication, again, that makes you happy. Wow, Pisces. How do you feel about this person, Pisces? How do you feel about them? There may have been somebody else. It could be an earth sign. It could be focused on money or something, but there could also be another person. Maybe you feel like they were stable, but then they were became, became like unstable because it talked about something about their foundation, 
maybe they're spending a lot of money on like legal battle or you know like maybe they didn't have the time or money or energy for you or something so it's like they were unstable or something like that maybe they were juggling you and another person two of coins could be juggling you maybe there's an earth sign involved something like that okay what do you see this person doing next when it comes to pisces a brand new beginning with the world the judgment card king of cups this could be you or them coming back towards you they want to start over what else I feel like they realize they have a fear of commitment. They may be telling you that. They may be saying that they overcome it. They feel like they want to be in love. They want to be in this connection. They may express themselves better this time around as well. So as someone who maybe was very closed off, maybe much more open. You guys could be dating or going out or having a lot of fun. Some of you may be Aries Cuspers. You may come up as a queen of wands or just this is how they view you. I feel like you could be going... Maybe going away together, going on a short trip or vacation or something like that, or just going out more. Yeah, they may apologize. This might be an air sign, but I do see them possibly apologizing here with the Five of Cups because they are brokenhearted. So this, that's what this said. It said that they are feeling very anxious and stressed out lately. They're heartbroken. Uh, they have a heavy heart. They want to do... Do something or give you something in order to make up for this. Social media pride and kisses can't let go. Now, I don't know if you're, you've posted things on social media, but um, maybe you posted other people or something like that and it's kind of made them jealous or something. But all right, what else does Pisces need to know at this time? Some may have the name like Katie. I'm getting a name like Katie. Kate, Katie. Okay, Crystal. That was already flipped around in the deck. That's okay. It says, time to go out and have some fun and some happiness. If you've been feeling very down lately, the energy may be getting lighter. You may be having more fun. That could be you getting dressed up, the Queen of Wands with the Three of Cups, going out and having some fun, whether with this person or with some friends. Uh, there's also a man here, it says, who may want to marry you. It says, lighthearted, carefree time. Compliments from a from an admirer, and you'll be shown the way. Some of you have a, have somebody else, someone else, um, maybe like giving you compliments, telling you they like you, something like that. And it says you're on the road to success. So it could be this person. Just says dealings or relationship with a man, marriage, but also compliments from an admirer. So. Think you have a couple cards here of things being easier. So if you have been feeling stressed, Pisces, Pisces, it could be a lighter energy. Yeah, and I see. I think some of you are gonna be going on vacation. You could be going with your just by yourself or with some friends or with this person. Maybe, maybe the two of you will go on a getaway if you decide to work things out. So, all right. Uh, anything else, Spirit? What does Pisces need to know? Love. Love is definitely in the air for you. It's, it's coming through the different decks. So, but love, just go with the flow. If you are looking to meet somebody new, go with the flow. Spirit's going to bring somebody in for you. You have new love. You have this past person who's thinking about you, yes, but you also have somebody new that I'm getting here. I feel like you're going to meet them in person. It won't be online. It'll be in person uh, when you're out. So, Somebody wants to apologize to you. It says you can expect to hear the apology. It could be from a friend. It also says friendship, longing, and obsessing about you. So have boundaries. Soulmates under this deck as well. When this person comes back, I feel like they're going to be a little bit like overwhelming. Like they are longing and obsessed with this connection with you. They want to be at least friends. It feels like they want you in your life. They want to be in your life any way they can. If you don't want them back as a partner or lover, they want to be at least friends. It's kind of what I'm getting. So true love, playfulness. See, so I feel like this connection can be kind of heavy too. It's like you need a connection where you're not always fighting, where you guys get along, you have fun, you play, you know, you go do things. You don't, you need a connection where you're not sitting around. So keep that in mind too, because I feel like you have a partner coming in 
who's gonna be more lighthearted, be more fun, wanna go out and do stuff. Whereas this other connection is kind of like it was heavy, there was a lot of arguing, they didn't treat you that well, maybe they didn't go out or take you out or anything like that. So just be aware, like you deserve a good partner, Pisces. And I feel like Spirit's gonna bring you in one with this other person so you can choose between the two. It's kind of what I'm feeling, they do that a lot. So I'm gonna leave it there, you guys. Have a great weekend.